No, he's filming himself <laughs> on the field. <laughs> Why? Why are you filming Oh, that's a, that's a very good question. So, what it is, is uh, I use YouTube. Have you heard of YouTube? Egypt. YouTube, know. not oh, Egypt. Oh, YouTube. I thought you said Egypt. <laughs> good morning, everyone. I thought I would uh, take a walk and also discuss something that happened last week when I came back to England. So... I received a call from a lady that used to uh, help me with my account and she said she wanted a website designed. At that moment, I was like, now, you know what? I need to focus on my YouTube channel and my affiliate marketing. So I was just about to decline and she said, look, I really need this website and I'm really desperate. So at this point, you know, I was really broke because I spent so much money in Zimbabwe and things didn't work out for me while I was over there. So financially, I was in a bit of a situation. And to be honest, I just felt like just resting and just sleeping. I really um, felt down for the whole week. I didn't even work. So anyway, she convinced me and I decided to go for the meeting. So while we were at the meeting, she showed me her old website or her current website. And to be fair, it didn't really look nice. I think um, what the designer tried to do was to uh, create a pretty website that did not really uh, bring the results that she was looking for. So as I was looking through this website, I realized that there are some improvements that I could make. But the most important thing is while she was speaking, she made uh, specific comments or specific uh, instructions that she needed for her website. And these instructions were she wanted a landing page where pe when people land on that page, they need to uh, know what she's doing, what she does. And in this case, she wants to uh, uh, help uh, small business owners, especially women. So we had to get that value proposition. So anyway, that was an easy task to do. But things became a bit different now when she started talking about the automations and what the website had to do. Now remember, she is not someone who's very technical here, but she's talking about the features and what she wants on her website. So the first thing that she mentioned was she wanted to give something away for free. And at that point, I started smiling because I knew that lead generation is also very good. If she starts with an offer, it can be a bit difficult to uh, convert that. So anyway, she mentioned the next part and this part she wanted uh, automation, which meant that when someone um, signed up on her website, um, she, that person would get a free ebook, which was fantastic. And then when that free ebook um, is delivered automatically via email, the next stage was to then offer that person that has subscribed uh, the ability to upgrade to another service. So that was pretty cool as well. So anyway, I'm thinking now, I have all these tools that I've been buying and I haven't really utilized them. Why not just package them and make them work together? And this is where I started smiling inside because I knew that I could provide what she was asking for. So. Let's talk about the tools. So the first tool that I have is, of course, Divi. And uh, I have um, the unlimited, unlimited package or oh, unlimited websites. So I've got Divi. The next thing is for the lead generation, I needed Fluent Forms. So again, I have this package, which made it very easy for me to uh, do the lead generation. I also have Fluent CRM for the email automation and marketing, which is fantastic. Now, the next part, which was very important for her, was the ability to uh, take in some bookings. So again, when it came to the bookings, I have Fluent Booking. And the, and the good thing about this is Fluent Booking automatically uh, integrates with Fluent Forms, which meant if there's a booking, people will get an automated email and uh, you'll be able to go in and pretty much automate however you want. So just before I left, I thought to myself, well, 
why not do an upsell for something that could work really well for her? And this was project management. Because I knew that when she started getting a lot of bookings, she would probably need to manage her bookings and also her tasks. So I pitched her on this and I also um, included this in the quotation. So when I finished doing this, it gave me an idea that sometimes we may have all these tools and here I am feeling sorry for myself, broke, behind on my bills and just feeling down generally. And yet I have all these tools that I can package, start advertising and could also start making me money. So the reason why I'm doing this video is because, you know, some, uh, some of us, I mean, I don't know about you, but uh, you could be sitting on a lot of tools, a lot of plugins that you could package together and form a, a functional website that can give someone results or leads. This is the time now for us to really start packaging all these plugins to make them work for small businesses or clients. In fact, the idea that I have right now is to create websites for small businesses, but these websites are just, you know, done quickly. You don't have to spend so much time uh, designing them. But the goal of these websites is to increase sales and also increase some leads. So this for me is something that I think will solve my, uh, my issues in situations where I don't have uh, enough money because sometimes, you know, we stress and we feel so helpless, but the tools that we need for us to succeed are actually there. So this is why I am making this video. So when you take a look at all these uh, websites and tools that we've signed up for, you'll realize that we have quite a lot that we could uh, put together to create some websites. Now, I know this can be a lonely, uh, lonely journey. So I also created, hello. What are you doing? Oh, I'm filming myself. You're filming yourself walking on a field? Yes. Oh. <laughs> Do you want to say something to the camera? You know what we thought? How many hours he's had they going to put on it? Now he's filming himself <laughs> on the field. <laughs> Why? Why are you filming oh, yourself? Oh, that's, that's a very good question. So what it is, is uh, I use YouTube. Have you heard of YouTube? Egypt. YouTube, know. not oh, Egypt. Oh, YouTube. I thought you said Egypt. <laughs> YouTube. YouTube. YouTube, YouTube, yes. I like yes. Facebook. You like Facebook? Okay. And uh, next door. Okay, next door. It's, it's a thing for Wollaston, the next door, and you go on and you uh, um, you talk about neighbours and things. All oh, things next, next same, door, okay. Next door, <laughs> yes. Right, so you know why I do these videos? Um, I design websites. Yes. So sometimes when you design websites and you have all this knowledge to yourself yeah, yeah, and you yeah. do it at home, yeah. it's beneficial to share your ideas with mm -hmm. others. Mm -hmm. So... When I do these videos, I put it on YouTube and I share ideas with others. And these are people all over the world. Ah, oh, right. Oh. Yes. Well, we so are it, the merry widows of Wollaston. <laughs> with our thoughts. How many houses are they going to build this survey? I thought you were pacing, <laughs> right in the I thought you were pacing out at first. <laughs> well, that's 30. Okay. This is Ben, they're best friends. Oh, they're best friends. Ben, he's six. <laughs> this is Elaine and I'm Anne. Very pleased to meet you. Okay, nice to meet you too. <laughs> Oh, Elaine, nice to meet you too. My name is Augustine, but you can call me Mac. Augustine? Yes. I like that. Why? Why do you like that? Well, Mac the Lion. <laughs> Mac, Mac the Knife. Mac the Knife. What about Augustine? Why do you like that? Well, it's a knife. It's better than like a vegetable aubergine. <laughs> <laughs> really? Me. Vegetables? Really? <laughs> okay, we're on your film. <laughs> By the way, I've been filming while we were speaking. Oh, are, you, are you okay with that? <laughs> you <more none>. <laughs> <laughs> He'll put his met two idiots. Uh, no, 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 no. The no. widows of Wollaston are well known. Because we're really? nosing into things. So where about you live? I live in those flats over there. Oh, over there. My friend lives in a, a cul-de-sac further up the 
street. All oh, right, I live just behind there. All oh, right. <laughs> anyway, it's been nice talking to yes, you. Yes, very nice. Thank you. Sorry, I've disturbed. Sorry. Have you moved into the new building? No, 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 no. Can't afford that. Oh. <laughs> I live in the old ones. Have a good day. Thank you very much. Nice talking to you. And you. Cheers. Okay, where was I? <laughs> I forgot now. Anyway, I was saying we have uh, quite a lot of tools and uh, sometimes these tools are so powerful that we can create um, websites that we can pitch to customers. Now, I've created a community called Div University. This is a community that could help um, those who are feeling stuck or you want some inspiration, ideas and so on. So go ahead, it's free at the moment. Go ahead and sign up. The link to that is in the video description below. Now I'll also be going through the steps of how I am building this website for, for this client. So keep an eye, be sure to subscribe and also hit the bell notification because by doing so you'll be notified when I release new tutorials. Anyway, guys, until next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.